pleasant times are the times that we're spending with ourselves. When we are scared and afraid and not even able to think about any way to deal with our thoughts, we need to connect ourselves to the root of our soul, means to listen to the inner voice, the quiet voice of our souls, and just to tune ourselves calmly and honestly to the inner voice of our soul, our spirit. When you're aware to your thoughts, you can deal with them. But when you're too scared to think about them, to hear them, and you're just being chased by them and running away, you're surrendering to your fears by that. When you surrender yourself to your fears, they get the power and the authority to control your life, to abuse you, to hurt you, and to scare you away from your eternal success. But when you're facing your fears and you're dealing with them, and you're thinking to yourself, okay, What's the worst case scenario? What is the worst thing that can happen to me? And then you think about it a little bit more. And you try to find ways to solve your problems, to deal with your issues, try to figure out ways, try to think, write it down if it's hard for you to keep all this information in your mind. Write down, journalize your thoughts, your feelings, your emotions, and then try to find solutions. And if you cannot find a solution and those feelings are terrifying you and you're so overwhelmed and lost, it's the time to pray. And then open your heart, open your mouth and talk to the maker of the universe like you talk to your best friend and tell him, listen, I'm afraid, I'm scared. I don't have an advice. I don't know what to do. I need a solution. I have a problem here. There's an issue here. I don't know what to do. I don't know how to deal with my pressure, with my anxieties, with my fears, with my depression. I'm lonely, I'm sad, I'm broken, I'm terrified, I'm lost, I'm confused. The honest words that will come out of your heart will bring the salvation towards you. The words of the prayer of the person are like light bulbs, like a shiny good stone that is spreading light around you and even in the worst darkness of them all they are shining and they're allowing you to find the openings the ways out of your darkness of your trap and you should just be honest even if you're in the worst place of them all in the darkest hour of your life that you've never been in a place that is so low that is so impure that is so scary that is so the worst of its kind and no one else ever experienced something so dark in their lives ever before from that place if you'll just be honest and express your feelings your emotions and your thoughts and just going to express it in simple individual prayer simple conversation with your maker telling listen i'm done i'm over i don't have no power no strength no battery No energy. Save my life. I need you to save me. I failed. I messed up. I did all the worst things I could ever think of. Save me. I need you to reveal your unconditional love upon me. I need you to reveal your loving kindness upon me. I need you to save me. Honest prayers are bringing the salvation faster and closer than you can imagine. Because Hashem is close to everyone, to everyone who will call Him with truth. So say the truth. And even if the truth is the most humbling thing that you can think of, and it's embarrassing yourself, you feel embarrassed talking about the truth, admitting it, even in front of your own self. That is the way out of the darkness. Because the process of atonement is to come back to the place where you came out from. You need to come back in the same path to your holiness. So you failed in certain actions, you failed in certain thoughts. You need to review them and to do tshuva on them. Means to say to Hashem, I'm sorry, it was wrong, I messed up, I failed, I need salvation, save me. Help me to correct what that I missed, what that I ruined and spoiled. 
And when you do that and you express your regret and your hopes for the future in prayer, when you do that, great things, great light, great salvation is being sent towards you. When the blessing of Hashem is shining in great light to a great success and a great salvation to you, to all your loved ones, and to the general public of the world, and to the whole wide world. Amen. You know me, my name is RDMC, with the Muna Project, all the nations with me, close your eyes, just breathe, see the truth, don't chase the fake world, don't buy the fake news, be yourself, your own true self, don't let no one take our natural wealth, see the good. From an endless spring, light up courage in yourself. You they feel. can kick you down to the ground, hold yourself up to you, up but up your crown. King of the Creator, holy soul inside. Focus on the spiritual and you shall. Você está assistindo Emonar Português. Seu apoio nos ajuda imensamente. Por favor. Inscreva-se, curta e deixe-nos um comentário com qualquer dúvida que você tenha. O melhor de tudo é simplesmente compartilhar este vídeo, ajudando essas mensagens de fé a chegarem a todas as pessoas. Não importa a sua origem. Fique bem e Shalom!